say <laughs> what's up beautiful people to do. oh my gosh we are so excited what is today well you guys see from the title but we're today about to go meet our potential um, puppy i've never had a dog i'm very this is gonna be an adjustment even me going in this house with all these puppies it's gonna be like ooh. So we'll see. Yeah, let me see. It's about two hours from us. So the breeder, very responsible breeder at that. Um, so we are about to take a little mini road trip and go meet these babies. So we'll see which one we end up selecting. And then, um, yeah, we're gonna take you guys with us. You all are cute and I'm all casual. How you gonna be looking all cute for the puppies and I'm looking all well, I go regular? Me. Well, do I look too basic? One of us is fine, so I mean. But am I, I'm saying, do I look too basic? I mean, you got on sweats. <laughs> but I don't want us to look like we're on two different pages. Well, go change Babe! Go ahead. What, what am change? I supposed to change into? I don't know. You got some jeans or, uh, I don't know. I'm wearing sneakers, so. But my hair is done. You think I'm fine? Show the people me. <laughs> she looks very road trippish. Do you think they're gonna be like, oh, you're not qualified to? I mean, I don't have know. A dog, I just whatever. always go to, I always go to be like most presentable. That way, no one is. There's no judgment. At least, hopefully, there's no judgment. So should I change or no? Yeah, we can be on the same page. Just go change. Uh, Make it quick. two hours it is Boy. almost 4 20 it's 4 21 our appointment is at 4 30 so uh i'm a little excited slash nervous how do you feel babe are you excited yeah, we're ready to go. um so we're gonna get to her to the breeder's house at like 4 25 and we're gonna see if we want this puppy if we do want this puppy we come back in two weeks to get the puppy because the puppies are six weeks old and they send them home at eight weeks so we won't be taking it home today but we will be like seeing if we like it if it likes us yeah all the things and i don't know if y'all know this but i've literally never had a pet so of any kind, not a bug, not a turtle, not a fish. My mom claims that we have fish growing up, which we never did. Like, I don't know why she's the fish don't saying even count that. All you do is feed it. It's still a pet. No bunny, no hamster, <laughs> none of that. So I have literally no pets. experience with pets. However, babe, what have I been doing a lot? Researching. Yes, I have been researching so much and um, I even started buying stuff for the dog So hopefully we actually do get the puppy because I mean I've started buying things. I'm already invested. So super invested <laughs> I'm just hoping that like it listens to me, you know, she's like dog crazy right now. I'm yeah I really hope it listens to me and like likes me because I've never had that type of connection with an animal. So, <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Oh, I'm a little nervous. But I can't seem nervous because I don't want the dog to think that I'm, like, scared of it, you know? Yeah, but the dogs are puppies. They can't Yeah, they're them. really small. So. It's only six weeks old today. Yeah, they probably don't even have, like, teeth all the way. So. Anyway. All right. We'll uh, keep you posted. Oh my gosh, babe, how do you feel? Guys, I'm a girl dad. He is a girl dad. Okay, so here's what happened. Before we 
went inside the breeder was like okay i have some bad news because she knew we wanted a boy and she was like we have a girl left you either can come in and see it or if you want a boy you have to wait until the next litter which is in october august but we won't yeah we wouldn't be able to take the dog home till october yeah and so we were like, we'll just go in and see. She had two girl dogs left. And so I held one and I didn't, I wasn't vibing with that one. But the one that we got, oh my gosh, she's so cute. How did I do? So we're taking the dog home because Erin did exceptionally well. Like <laughs> the first dog she held, not her vibe. Mm -mm. This dog, I was like, we gotta take her home. Yeah. So. So. This is how I be. This this is what girls do to you. Like. Yeah. Shit. We're gonna be girl parents, and she's gonna be so spoiled. We don't have a name. We will officially introduce her once we get her in a couple weeks. Yeah. So. Anyway, very successful. Home. Now we have to take this long drive home, and then maybe I'll show you guys some of the stuff that I bought for her already. And they gave us a um. A little goodie bag full of like dog essentials which was really nice so rode home to prep our house for our baby girl I have to buy her so much more stuff oh my god <sighs> all right we are back home and I want to show you guys some of the things that I got for the puppy I actually bought all this stuff before I even knew that we were gonna get the puppy <laughs> so um Anyway, first things first is a bed. Also, most of this stuff is from Home Goods, and then I'll show you some of the stuff that we got from the breeder because they also gave us some stuff, which was really nice. So I got this donut bed from Home Goods. It was twenty-five dollars, and on Amazon these are like seventy-five dollars, which is crazy. Um, but yeah, I thought it was so cute. So that's that. Where's that one going? I think I'm gonna put this one in our bedroom. But we'll see. Um, and then also from Home Goods, I got this slow feeder, which I heard is great for mental stimulation. So what you do is you put their food in and it's like zigzag and it like helps like kind of mentally stimulate them while they eat. So I got that. It was $8.99. Again, like way cheaper at Home Goods. Also got a toy. I tried to get toys that weren't like too girly or too boyish because again, I got this and we didn't know like what we were gonna have. So cute little soccer ball. I also got these like squeaky toys. I don't know if we're gonna regret this, but. We're definitely gonna regret it. Oh man. Well yeah, got these little squishy thingies. And I got some poop bags because even though like you can use grocery bags, we just don't be having that many because the grocery stores we go to, I paper. they all do paper bags. So I got these and it's like 240 of them and they, they were $6.99. So I got those and I got these puppy teething rings. Now I am still researching about dog food and like good dog food. Um, but I know the puppy's gonna be teething when we get her because I don't know, I feel like it's just gonna be teething because that's the age range. So I got these puppy rings. I, I kind of want to look at the reviews, but we'll see if she likes them or the puppy. We'll see if the puppy likes them. Um, and then the breeder actually gave us a bed. So we will use this bed when we go pick the puppy up. Um, I'm sure the puppy will be sitting on my lap when we go pick, pick it up. So, gonna use this one. I thought that was really nice of them to give us a little doggy bed. And then they gave us a bag full of things. So, we got some t-shirts. Our breeder is called Bainbridge Labradoodles. And a little toy. How cute is this? toy that is so cute it's a little llama so they gave us that and then what is this 
Oh, some little uh, That's the treat. Treat samples and stuff. Treat they samples. They gave us like a few bags of treat samples. I wonder if they're gonna give us dog food. No, we have to get dog food. Mm. And they gave us a little journal for the puppy and like some information. So I thought that was so nice of them. And wait, did we get a blanket? We did get a blanket. Where is that at? Did you ever pick one? I don't think we picked oh, one. We maybe we, we didn't. No, we'll have to get the blanket when we go back. Um. So, if you have a puppy, please let me know down below what some things that we need are. We still have to get a crate. Um, we're going to crate train. We still have to get food. Uh, oh, I got shampoo and stuff too. I don't know where that is. Okay, found the shampoo. Um... Also got this from Home Goods. It's called Pride. It's by Pride and Groom, called the Sensitive One. Anyway, look this up, and it was like thirty dollars, and I'm like, wow, that's more than my own shampoo. And it was only twelve ninety nine at Home Goods, so I got two bottles of it. Hopefully, we like it. And then I got the conditioner. I actually did a little bit of research and saw that they have really good reviews. It is a small business. I think it's woman owned. Don't quote me because I don't know if I remember correctly. I've been doing so much research. Um, so I was really happy to see that they had some more luxury um, products there. So I picked those up for a little pup pup and I think that's about it. Anyway, let me know all your puppy suggestions, any advice you have about food, about training. This will be my absolute very first time ever having a pet. So it will be an adjustment, but I'm looking forward to it. Um, anyway, we'll keep you posted. We'll let you know when, you, when we get the dog and we'll formally introduce you because I think we're really going to love her. Anyway, love you guys and we will see you on the next one. Bye for now.